And in our case, um, we have two 75 megawatt PV projects that were awarded to us. And uh, we achieved financial close last week. And early in the new year, we will start construction on those projects. All right, so it's not going to be an immediate benefit to consumers or even households as such because you have to make sure that the infrastructure is in place uh, and that you've got the necessary skill sets as well. How far are we enrolling out these particular projects? So, as I said, we just achieved financial close last week, which effectively means that we have fulfilled all the conditions required to now start construction. Construction will start in January of 2024, and the projects will be connected to the grid in Q4 of 2025. Uh, that is the time at which um, we would be adding the power to the grid. And this power is primarily for residential consumption, or are you also in the industrial space? No, so this power is contracted directly to ESCOM, so we will dispatch this power into the grid and of course the benefit of adding this capacity into the grid means that residents and industries have the benefit of an additional 150 megawatts that is now connected to the grid i mean you introduced the topic by saying that for many many years we in south africa have a shortfall in capacity and hence we are now experiencing load shedding and as i look on your screen it says that we are stage three load shedding. So the addition of additional capacity will in time allow the country to get back to a position where there is sufficient capacity to meet the demand of power in the country.